Hello lovely people, welcome back to my channel, or hello if you're new, thank you so much for being here. I'm looking a little tired today, because I am tired today, but I'm sat at the computer because I'm going to go through um, my Etsy orders, because yesterday I launched brand new products on my shop and I sold some of them, which is amazing, I feel so so grateful. I also hit a thousand Etsy sales, which was my goal for the end of May and it was getting so close and I was like mm, I'm just not gonna do it and I was trying to think what I could do to you know improve that I know I had a shop update coming but again you, you never know with shop updates it could be so hit or miss but thankfully it did really well um Odin is moving the tripod again <laughs> I'm feeling quite tired today but very positive I'm gonna go through my computer and write down everything that I need to collect. And then I think I'm gonna maybe do an Instagram live. I did one yesterday to go through the new products and it left me feeling really good. So I think I'm gonna do that and pack some orders. So yeah, I'm gonna write everything down on my little to-do list. Sorry if you can hear I'm doing whining. He's just decided as soon as I've got the camera out that he's gonna chat away to me. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna go through the listings and, and see what I need to collect. Okay, so this is the list of everything that I need to collect together. Oh, I'm so, so happy. It's so nice to see so many lovely goodies on here and to see like, you know, what's been most popular as well, like on the day of launch. So yeah, I'm gonna collect all this now, line it up, and then I think I'm gonna go live on Instagram to pack it. That should be so fun. So I've just laid everything out in what people have ordered. So this is an order, this is an order, this is an order, and then it goes like like this. Um, look at all the lovely goodies. Oh my gosh, this makes me so, so happy. I was just so anxious about this. And then I've got my little pots of freebie tiny snails, which are adorable. Um, I've just put them in the top of a candle lid pot um, so that I can pop them on my desk when I pack them all. But yeah that's everything thank you so so much if you purchased and again all of these items are now available on my etsy shop if you wanted to have a little look i'll put a link in the description hello um it's the next day and i actually have a guest with me for the next couple of days my sister is here um what are you doing you're doing a photography project mm -hmm. right yeah um about small businesses it's products about products and things so of course she chose me um so today we are actually painting some props that lauren got from poundland um she got some props from poundland this one looks like it has a poo <laughs> on the top of it um so we're actually painting it gray and gonna paint the door as well and then we've also got like a couple of little other ones that we want to change up a bit just so they go better with my products but she wanted to get some additional props and i mean you can't complain from hound really and we've got paint to change it so yeah that's that's our plan for the next half an hour or so probably isn't it um so we're gonna paint these and i'll put the camera on so you can see a little painting process and i'll show you what they look like afterwards as well i did actually get a couple more orders today which is really exciting i got a really big one to go to america so i'm going to pack that up later in the vlog because i know a lot of you guys like the packing segments and things i'm going to stop talking now because I find it weird having Lauren here while I <laughs> while I chat. So um yeah, we're gonna get painting these.
So we just put up a backdrop in the living room over the dining table. This is what the painted items came out like. The top of it still looks a little bit like poop, but it is grey. I don't know, the camera's picking it up as a bit brown, but it is quite a nice light grey. And then we just painted the honeycomb. Lauren painted this little like pumpkin house and painted the snail to match the stickers that I released recently. So that one's really, really cute. And then we also painted this little rose bush ornament. So these flowers were kind of a peachy orange colour. Um, and now they're quite a nice yellow. So they look really, really cute. Um, and now we're going to set up and start, well, Lauren's going to start taking photos of some of my products. Hello, um, apologies for the terrible lighting. Um, it is now <laughs> the end of Sunday. I have just sat down to start editing this vlog, which is quite late. Um, also, I apologize for a reflection in my glasses. Um, the sun is setting and yeah, I just am a little bit late on concluding the vlog. I had my sister here this week, as you would have seen. Um, I was helping her with a photography project. Um, we did an interview on Friday, um, so I helped um, her do that. Um, so the rest of the week kind of ran away with me, and I feel like I didn't have as much to show you guys. Um, yeah, I was hoping to pack a couple of orders as well for the end of this vlog, but yeah i just haven't been able to um i kind of just want to get this vlog edited and out probably it's going to be a little bit later than normal so maybe tuesday so if if you want to see some packing order packing if that's kind of the stuff that you like in vlogs then next week is the one for that because i'm really hoping to get the camera out and do some order packing um which yeah it's just gonna be really fun um but yeah i had the most amazing weekend this weekend because as i mentioned in last week's vlog i took part in the e hearts market which is run by the wonderful emily harvey she is an illustrator who is just so wonderful and lovely and launch not launches um runs markets for her patrons i think twice a year and it's been so wonderful getting to know some more people finding new creators of course it's wonderful getting orders and things but the markets just feel so I just feel so connected with everybody. I did a last minute live with Rebecca from Rebel Jones Design and other people joined. So Lainey from the Odd Bod Stop. Um, I think you watch these vlogs, Lainey. I'm so proud of you. Lainey did her first Instagram chatty um, story yesterday and then was brave and came on a live with me and Becca, which was amazing. We also had the wonderful Gemma um, from Wish Art Studios, Lauren from Pinned Harder Designs. Um, so it was really lovely to have them come on so spontaneously and to just chat and connect and yeah it was so so lovely. So thank you um, Becca for agreeing to go live with me. I really appreciate it. But yeah I thought I'd just wrap up the vlog here because and like tie the week together because um, I, hadn't, I hadn't done that. So yeah I will chat to you guys next week. Um, should be a lot of packing i'm not sure just yet what else because i want to start working towards my kickstarter but again i want to limit how much i'm showing until i'm ready to really share it so that's me kind of done the lighting is not the best in here i do apologize but this is the best we're getting for right now because i need to get this vlog out um but yeah thank you guys so much for watching and i'll speak to you in next week's vlog bye